join us. Everyone's invited, of course. Hey, Star Wars fans and action figure collectors. Last but not least, out of the Mandalorian retro line, considering I don't have the Remnant Stormtrooper, it's an exclusive that I can't get. So we're going to go to Moff Gideon to wrap up the series. I'm looking forward to opening up this guy. Um, yeah, his vintage collection figure was fantastic. His Black Series figure was fantastic. So it's cool to see the main villain of the Mandalorian in sort of a retro vintage style. It looks kind of cool. There's the Darksaber. But yeah, nonetheless, let's crack it open and have a look. All right, folks, this impressive looking little action figure in front of you is, of course, Moff Gideon. He looks really, really cool. Um, obviously, they've gone with the sort of similar sort of Vader, Vader feel with this figure, you know, all black. See the big black vinyl cape. Awesome sort of red flashes throughout his armor and the outfit. And I love that he's got the moustache. Yeah, he's looking looking really, really good. I'm, I'm digging this one a lot. Black gloves, they look cool. All the sort of detail and stuff on his chest armor there looks great. Black boots. Love all the sort of straps up the front of his boots. That's nice. Very Vader looking gloves there. really really cool i was half expecting gideon to wear a helmet as well like almost a uh inquisitor sort of style helmet i thought we were going to get go there at some point um i can't remember when i thought that but uh there was at one point during season two i thought we were going to see him put on a helmet for combat but uh i'm kind of glad they didn't so he does come with two weapons it's when he has his little sidearm here which is sort of nice and compact, it's nice and small. And then we have the Dark Saber, which is just sort of gray plastic. Um, I think considering they went to all the trouble to do vinyl capes for these, I think and like a extending telescoping lightsaber would have been really, really cool. That would have just been a really nice homage back to the uh back to the Kenner days. But uh obviously they did switch to lightsabers at one point. Uh, I think it was for Empire Strikes Back. Get a look there. But that's okay. I think, yeah, had they gone, made it black, it would have been too much. Um, so kind of glad they went with the grey. Um, it works fine. We'll get that little blaster in this hand. And there we have Moff Gideon. Yeah, he's cool. I like him a lot. Need to get a uh, Beskar Mando. <laughs> It'd be great with a spear to face off against this guy. That'll be cool. You know they'll do one. They'll do a second wave. And it will be awesome. So that's really cool. Yeah, I'd love to hear your thoughts on Moff Gideon. And, uh, you know the collection overall please sound out in the comments down below if you like this video review please give it a thumbs up and uh if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet please do it'd be uh muchly muchly appreciated and uh hit the little notification bell so you don't miss any future videos so that wraps up my little retro collection set of reviews for the mandalorian um if i do get a hold of the retro rem remnant stormtrooper at some point i will add that into the little playlist that this will be a part of um but yeah thank you very very much for watching really do appreciate all your support and all your views and all your likes and all your comments and everything else in between um yeah until my next video may the force be with you always